completed. Uh, oh, hi. Welcome back to Subnautica. I, I just had my morning coffee because I believe the sun has just risen very... not too long. Okay, maybe a couple of hours ago. But today is a big day, ladies and gentlemen, because we are going on a mission. We are going... Thank you. We are going to the Aurora. And I'm very excited for it. I think we have everything we need. We have extra batteries. We have light. We have plenty of first aid kits. We have water. We have food. And I think we're ready. Or maybe we're not. Who knows? Uh, we also have fire extinguishers. Yeah, we're just gonna go. We're, we're just gonna go. Um, do I have my radiation stuff on? I do indeed. High capacity. Compass. Let's go to the sea moth and let's get to it. I'm very excited for this. This is a big moment. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We are heading to the Aurora, which should be, yep, in this direction. Now, I don't actually know where the entrance is, so we're just going to have to um, get close to the Aurora and then figure it out as we go, I guess. So here goes, and hopefully we live to tell the tale. And there it is. We are getting close now. Now, if we find something on the way that looks interesting, I guess we might make a pit stop, but we do have an Aurora to get to. Um, I think we've probably already been there. Oh, hi. Little shark thing. That looks scannable, though, if I'm not mistaken. Nope. It's, oh, it's an open thingy thing. Okay, hello. Please don't eat me. That would be not so good. Okay, here we go. Close to the Aurora. Um. Okay. Okay. Hello. Now, I don't know, again, where the entrance is, so... Let's try looking over here by the engines, maybe. Taking a look and see if we can find something close by. I mean, there could be maybe some holes somewhere, maybe. Gotta watch out for the cliffs as well. Yeah, these are the engines. This is what... Well, the reactor blew up, remember? Oh, wow. Uh, this is big. <laughs> what on earth? Huh? Oh, hello. Okay. Um. Yeah. I, yeah. Okay. Okay. I have no control whatsoever. Okay. 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 Hold up. Okay. Okay. Right. That um. That did some damage. <laughs> Okay, not going towards the engines. That. Oh boy. We have the hull upgrade on, so we may not have survived that had we not had that. Oh boy. Um. Nope, that's the wrong button. That's the wrong button. Yeah, let's repair the Seamoth and let's try and go a different way. I actually thought maybe the Seamoth would get destroyed from that. That was, um... Okay. Oh yeah, we have laser cut and pathfinder tool and some flares as well. Okay, good. Good. We're not going that way. <laughs> uh, that was something else. Alright, we're going towards the front of this thing, whatever that's called. Oh, hold on though. I'll be safe. Looks safe. Uh, propulsion can fragment. Hello. Ooh, new blueprint. New blueprint acquired. Okay, and did I not see? Yep, I did indeed. One of these fellas. Uh, ooh, water. Actually, I will take that. Special equipment is required to collect this resource. I assume the laser. I think I tried the laser cutter, and I don't think that that is enough. What's this? Cannon. Okay, while I do need titanium, I am not going to be hunting for titanium or gathering titanium today. Also, the sun is going down already. This is 
not ideal. I'm just looking to see if there's anything else, like, scannable, now that we're here anyway. Um, but now that it is night time, it is quite creepy around here, and I don't want to have another encounter like that again. Because that was scary, and this just got even scarier, because it's now night time. That happened way faster than expected, to be honest. What's here? Maybe more water? First aid kit. In this region are sparse. The oh. Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next oh. 24 hours. Please don't give me a timer. Please do not give me a timer in the game. I don't do well with timers. Okay. Oh. Hear me. Oh. Oh, this might be our entrance. This might be our entrance entrance point. Okay, so if we don't contain whatever is happening here, apparently it will have devastating effects on this planet within 24 hours. Okay. Or at least devastating effects on the life on this planet. Hello? Oh. Okay. Let's get close, but not too close. Here is probably good. Okay. Like I've played this game before, but I haven't been here before. And laser cutters may be required. Exploration is conducted at your own risk. Got it. These guys would also... would be great if those guys weren't attacking. Okay. Um... Starting to see that propulsion cannon might have come in handy. <laughs> okay. Well, let's explore. Um... Scan and see what's up. I think if I just leave those guys alone, they're not going to attack me too much. Oh man, this is, um... There's something else. There's a lot of fires. Still burning even after days upon days of exploding. Caution. Scans show the digestive oh. tracts of nearby life forms contain human tissues. Oh okay. Maybe those crabs are not the only ones then. Hi, ow. Please go away. Um Yeah, this seems safe. That's definitely safe. Well, I mean, I guess there's water below, so that's fine. Ooh, what's this? Disinfected water. All right, I will have some filtered water. There we go. Nice. Okay. I I have to say this. Ga Ow. This game is just like. It's just really, really good. <laughs> Especially the visuals, like, it's beautiful. And the sound as well and everything. Okay, we, it looks like we're heading a little bit further into the Aurora now. Heading towards what seems to be maybe an entrance. Ooh, a fire extinguisher. Let's take it. Ow! Go away! Don't... Go... Yeah, okay. I will take a first aid kit now that I have been provided it, and I will also take this because I need to go through this door, it seems. Okay. And put out some of the some of these fires. I think it's good I grabbed so many med kits. Okay. I do need to preserve it, though. Okay. And access this. And again, the door is already open. Well, we're now exploring, and this is officially creepy. <laughs> I don't know if I should put out these fires or not. Aurora systems are running 
on local reserve power. Okay. Unable to remotely download black box data. So we have to find. So that is probably administration. Cargo base seems interesting, but I feel like we should go to administration first. Let's see. Sleep mode. Loading voice recognition. Engineer Barkley and Chief Technology Officer you identified. Drone, get me a propulsion cannon. Repulsion cannon retrieved. Hey, Berkeley, install that circuit box with that repulsion cannon and you'll punch a hole in the cargo bay. Damn it, drone, I said propulsion, not repulsion. <laughs> Calibrate sensors. Sensors recalibrated. Sensors aren't the problem. I tweak the program. It's like you now. It doesn't like being told what to do. <sighs> drone, I know... His name's Albert now. <laughs> Albert, I know it's not your fault, but it would really help me do my job if you'd bring me what I asked for. Thanks for your time. Propulsion can retrieved. Thank you. Now go away. Entering hibernation mode. Boss, this hobby of yours isn't making my job any easier. Or safer. Maybe so, but it's all that's stopping me from being so bored. I take a spacewalk in my skivvies. Oh, oh wrong button. Okay, uh, yeah. Cargo Bay, last. Uh, administration first. Let's see what is happening here. Let us see what is going on. I really feel like I should put out these fires. But I also feel like I should save the fire extinguishers for events like this, you know. So let's go ahead and clear a path into administration. <gasps> ah! Nah, 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 nah. Bad. Bad fire. Very bad fire. Okay, this one is now empty. Can I now drop then? How do I drop? Uh, drop. There we go. Okay, and it automatically grabs a new one. Okay, cool. Uh. Ooh, poster. I'll take a poster. I'll take a poster. Integrating new PDA data. Okay. Notes to self. So here we are, finally in open space. We cross the galaxy to install a phase gate to send ships to mine resources to build more expensive ships to install fancier phase gates. Are we trying to exhaust the galaxy or just ourselves? Uh, that's updates. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Ooh, data terminal. Oh. Okay. Terra launches the Aurora. Oh dear, I need to read. Okay. Ahem. <clears throat> Phase gate announcement for the uh, Aridne arm. Altera launches the Aurora. The furthest reaches of inhabited space are due to expand as Altera Corporation launches a newly constructed capital ship carrying a phase gate bound for the Ari A Ariadne arm. Ariadne. Hmm. I'm probably butchering that, but let's go. We're rolling with it. The Aurora will travel from a space dock on the edge of Altera space, making hundreds of consecutive phase gate jumps through nine different transgov trans authorities and arrive on the far side of the Ariadne arm in three months' time. From there, the command crew will pilot the ship beyond the final phase gate, arriving in the next solar system approximately 18 months later. There, the elite team of engineers will begin a six-month construction project on the new phase gate, a multi-trillion credit investment. In the absence of existing infrastructure in the region, the vessel is equipped with advanced thermal and nuclear power facilities. Altera Corporation currently operates 9% of all phase gates in the galaxy. If the Aurora's mission is successful, Altera will have outmaneuvered a cabal of Mongolian corporations operating a range of outposts and mines in the region. I keep pressing the wrong button. Very interesting. Any more? Download data. Already downloaded the data. All right. Let's... Wait, that was it then. That was it in this room, I think. Okay. I guess we're going to the cargo bay. Leave this fires here, these fires here. That's the exit. The... Uh... I guess we can scan this, get some titanium. And the sun is coming up from the looks of things, making it a little bit less scary. Can I get over there? Oh, I can. Hello. Okay, so we're definitely going down there afterward. Oh, I can't go through this. Okay, so that is blocked, clearly. That's unfortunate. So, 
We're not going to the cargo bay, we're going somewhere else, apparently. Um... Eh. Nope, wait, can I just walk under this? I can't really crouch. I, eh, come on. I can, I can make that jump. There we go. Nope. Nope. Hmm. Am I not meant to go? I am very confused. I feel like I'm being prevented from going in that direction. Okay, don't think I can get through that. But this cannot be it. Oh, wait a minute. What if I... do this? Can I walk on this? I cannot turn it off, but I can jump down! Haha! I don't know if I was supposed to do that or not, but here, I, here we are. They're probably saved first. Okay. Uh, key. Scans of damage to the Aurora do not match any known offensive technologies. Oh dear, I've lost so much health. What happened? Must have been that fire. Uh... Hmm. I don't know if any code. I don't think I got any code. That's interesting. Okay, I'm having a very good look around, because, uh... Never know... Where you're supposed to go. I have... I don't think I've gotten any codes... For this ship, so maybe this is where I'll have to come back to? However, that looks interesting, but I don't see a current way down. So there must be a gateway or a... Nope. Careful of that. Ow. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. There must be a way that I have missed. No? It actually doesn't look like I'm supposed to go there. Oh, so I went up. I didn't go down. Okay, well, let's try that then, I guess. Wait, I might just... Ah! Okay. Uh, that door was not stable. <clears throat> that's, uh... That's that. Okay. I walk across this. Yes, I can. Okay. Just gotta get down safely to where I was before and try the other way. Which I guess I overlooked because it was dark. That's my excuse. Ah, yeah, take a look at this. Now we're making some progress. That's water down there. Okay. Very good. Okay. Interesting. Well, let's see what we got here. Although that way does look kind of blocked. Ooh, battery. That's good. And water. I'll take that. Very good. Very, very, very good. Uh, what do we got here? You are infected. What can I scan? Ooh, floodlight. I'll take that. I'll take that scan. Do I need the propulsion cannon to... Like, be able to push this stuff away? Because I don't think I have a crouch button. I do, in fact, not. I think I need the propulsion cannon. Propulsion cannon. Wiring kit. So, if I add that and then wiring kit that's just two copper oh boy uh i may not have that but we're gonna have to try because i think that that is the only way i'm actually going to be able to get through and also probably how i was supposed to get through the other door if i'm being completely honest Welcome aboard, Captain. so let's try that ideally without what's this anything interesting down here Okay. No, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, let's go back home, get some more food, make that propulsion cannon, and then come back to this spot. I will actually, since I'm here, as long as I deem it safe, I will actually gather some resources if I see them and they are fairly easily accessible. What is this? 
Ooh, polish rust made a fragment. That sounds useful. Hello. Because I actually don't know if I have any copper at home. <laughs> and there's also some titanium spots here and there, which I guess I will take. Because I do need titanium as well back home. Okay, that's one piece of copper. That's very good. And might have some more up here. Be careful of my inventory size. Or inventory space. That's another copper. Alright, that's enough to make the wiring kit. Which is the primary thing that I needed it for. Alright, we are now home and hitting fishies. That's not ideal. Alright, let's put you into charge. Perfect parking. Look at that. Thank you. I will be gone very shortly, though. I just need to pick up a couple of things and craft a couple of things, most importantly. Alright, make a copper wire. And then we should be able to make... Uh... How much more wiring kit? Wait. Why did I need the... Oh, I thought... Okay. Okay, so I need two silver ore. Ooh, I don't know if I have that. I have one. <laughs> I have one silver. Please tell me I have more than one silver. Because if not, I have problems. There we go. Okay, good. Good, good, good. We can make a wiring kit. Very good. Here, make a wiring, wiring, wiring kit. Then I need one piece of titanium. Keep pressing the wrong buttons every time. And we can make a propulsion. Warps gravity to pull and push objects. Okay, so we can push things away from the doorways. Very good. Okay, nice. What's this? Creature decoy. Attracts creatures to its location. Can be deployed by hand or by submarine. Cannot be reclaimed to once deployed. Interesting. Okay, we now have... That's a big tool. That's quite big in the inventory. Hmm. Okay. So we're not going to be needing the repair kit at the moment. I think we're good. I just need to drink a little bit of water. I probably should bring more water with us, actually. I'm going to grab a bunch of fruits. And we should probably bring a bunch of these fruits with us, because they contain water as well. And I think we might get more water in there. We'll be getting, actually, quite a few resources when we've been there, so... Let's not hesitate any further. Let's go back out there. Hello, fish inside. <laughs> the sun is down, so hopefully the sun will be going up by the time we reach the Aurora yet again. Look at this during the night. Man, they're pretty. That's really, really cool. And I'm guessing the sun is slowly coming up now. Nope. Hmm. Interesting. It just got brighter. I think the sun's coming up. I think the sun's coming up. Maybe. Or maybe I'm just slowly losing my mind. Because it is still nighttime when I poke my head out. <laughs> Alright, this is getting creepy, but I'm loving the music right now. I'm loving the atmosphere. Very dark, very creepy. Just the light guiding the way. Pitch black. The creepy music. I'm loving this so much. All right, here we are again. Oh boy, thing is still shaking. All right, let's try this one more time, shall we? Hopefully, with the propulsion cannon crafted, we will be able to do this. Grab item, load item from inventory. Okay. So... Oh, okay. That's cool. That's very cool. Definitely not taken from Portal. <laughs> if you haven't played Portal, you don't know what I'm probably don't know what I'm talking about. Or I think what's that other other game? Half Life? Something? I'm not sure. Anyway. Bad. Th this thing's cool. It uses a lot of power. Rightfully so. Uh, can I potentially eat something? Do something? Let's eat another fruit, I guess. And we should be able to have that. Nice. Alright. Let's get rid of these fires. They're in our way. 
Okay. Nice. Oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. Okay, we have something down below and we have a closed door. One of the question is, can we cut through that door? Nope. Okay. Doesn't look like we can even access it. Ooh, battery. Okay, nice. Okay, I'm assuming don't hit those electrical wires. Um, can we power off this place? Ooh, lab access. New PDA data. I will read that. Uh, wait, hold on. What do we got here? Ooh, another code. Okay, another code. So we need potentially two codes, two locked doors. Okay, let's see what we got here. I got something in the oh dear data bank. Uh, hmm, codes and clues. Is this it? Before the last communications, Altara HQ uploaded a set of blueprints to the Aurora's main computer. There's a high security terminal inside the captain's quarters located behind the prawn bay from which the blueprints should be accessible. The code is 2679. And lab access. I wonder where we got that. If you need to tweak your equipment, please use the mod station in the forward section or retrieve pre-configured equipment from the lab next door to the data coil. The door code is 6483. 6483, okay. Well, we currently have access to two doors here. Don't know which one is which, it doesn't really say. Uh, so this is 2679. 20, nope, that's not it. Uh, 26, Nope, okay, that wasn't that one. And the other code, lab access, 6483. No. 64. 83. Ooh! Hello! Actually did something. Hi. Okay. Got something here. I guess we'll scan the counter. <laughs> uh, who doesn't want a counter, huh? And another door there. Sample analyzer, non-functional. Inventory full. I can pick this up. Oh, non-functional. So it's just, I guess, for decoration. I like decoration, though. I guess it's a 4x4. Four four. Yep, I want those. <laughs> I want those. Okay, we'll open that door in just a moment. Uh, let's grab this. What can we learn from the hive mind of the straight of 4? Or 6. Okay, data bank. And... Terra search and rescue mission. I don't think this is it. Man, okay, hold on. I need to sort through my, my thing here. Aurora survivors, that's not it. Codes and clues. Then we have Altera search and rescue mission. Don't think this is the one that we picked up, but still. Ex Auxiliary search and rescue mission. Uh, okay, that's not really relevant, I don't think. Uh, public documents, what can we learn from? Oh, this one. How? Oh dear me, that's... Okay, so I just read through this. If you wish to read it, you can pause at any time. I'll wait with actually scrolling so it's not shaking, so you can actually read the text uh, in case it's blurred. But you can read this if you wish. Uh, kind of interesting, but uh, very lengthy. And from what I can see, not directly uh, uh, related to this. Maybe I'm just not getting it. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, data terminal. Corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Eh? Oh, bat battery? I need a battery now? But it I'm very confused at this point in time. We will continue onwards. Oh, so that's how we got through here. Okay. Steel door cut to open access. Ooh, we can actually use the laser cutter, which I didn't bring with me. Are you kidding me? Okay, why did I not bring the laser cutter tool with me? I did not. Why did I not think of? Okay, I'll be right back. Thankfully, the sea moth is literally right there. Why did I not think of bringing the laser cutter tool? Of course, I will need it. This is a crashed ship. Oh, dear me. Okay, laser cutter tool. Pathfinder tool might even be used. I don't know at this point. Let's just go with it. All right, here we are. 
I need to watch my oxygen as well. Okay, laser cutter tool in place. Cutting through. Cutting through. A sealed door. This is so cool. <laughs> this is so cool. I do need to watch my oxygen though. I don't know if I can access oxygen anywhere else inside this ship, so... Mm. Hello. And we're going deeper and deeper. Okay. Guess I can... Cast some breath here. Okay. What do we have here? Here's terminal. Black box data. Integrating new PDA data. Okay, black box data. Initiated slingshot maneuver around planet uh, blah blah blah. High velocity energy pulse detected on planet surface, so we were shut down. Emergency distress signal sent to Altera listening for via long range calm relay. Impact detected, life pod base on the starboard side. Compromise, outgoing communications compromised, emergency evacuation initiated. Uh, manual piloting transfer to Captain Hollister. Life parts 01 to 25, launched successfully, entering planetary atmosphere. Massive impact registered, drive core shield compromised. Emergency bounce backs received from eight life pods on planet surface. Human life signs detected over long range at a T plus eight hours. One, eh? personal <laughs> unaccounted for, non-essential systems maintenance chief Riley Robinson. Altera HQ rescue resolution received at uh, blah blah blah, high priority terminal, monitoring equipment failed at T plus 13 hours. Okay. What do we have up here then? Very bad stuff. Anything over here? I don't think so. Let's move on. At least I can breathe. This is definitely blocked off. Oh dear me, this is a lot of piping. Okay. Right. I guess we're trying to shut down stuff, so negative effects are not happening. Really should use that Pathfinder tool, shouldn't I? I don't know if I'll be able to find my way out again. Why did the music change? The music changed. I know how video games work. Music change is not always good. What the f Oh, oh! Suits. Can I scan those suits? That would be really, really cool if I could. I'm just gonna make sure I'm not missing anything down here. That's electrocution. <laughs> Waiting to happen. Okay, no, that's not. Okay. I can't cut through this door. Use repair tool. Wait, I can do something here. I am not useless. Uh, repair tool. Replace with propulsion cannon. Repair, repair tool. Or repair, using repair tool. Okay, I can open the door. Locker room. And I'm going to need fire extinguisher. Instead of laser cutter. Okay. I guess let's just... We have plenty of fire extinguishers. Let's just get rid of his. Okay, that's leading down Prawn Bay. I don't know if I want to go down there just yet. Um, Let's see what we got here, though. No signal. Picking up a faint black box signature. Oh. Originating on the other side of the hull breach in this room. Copy that. Can I? Ooh. Front suit fragment. Hello. I assume I'm going to need, yeah, four of those. There's two more up there. Can I reach them? Uh, don't step into the fire. That hurts. I can reach this one. Hello. Oh, radio transmission. When we come back. Okay. Can I reach that one, I wonder? There's another one here. I must be able to reach that other one in the ceiling. Like I have, to, I think I just got two radio messages, maybe. 
Not quite sure, but I think I might have. Um, oh wait, there's another one over there by the fire. Can I scan you without having to take out the... Ow! Hmm. I don't know if I can actually take out this fire. I can. Nice. Very good. Okay. Prawn suit. Let's go. Like, part of me just want to... Like, fight all of this fire. But also... I don't think that's actually possible. <laughs> um, okay. I need to get up there. So for this... Looks like I'm going to need that repulsion cannon. Let's equip you. And... Oh, picking up you apparently. That's not what I wanted. That's better. Come on, fellas. Make way. Nope. I want you. Hmm. Oh, maybe this is good enough. Get rid of you. And this. Yeah, making it worse. Be gone. Hmm. There we go. Finally. Okay. Making progress, people. Making progress. Living quarters. Okay. Supply. Canteen. Let's go to the supply room. Nutrient block. Ooh. Oh, this is good. Water, water, water. This is awesome. Any more? Yep, right up there. That's really good, actually. <laughs> Bring some of that. Uh, that's 75 food. I think I'll... Mm, I'll save that for when I actually really, really, really need it. Because I don't at the moment. I don't think. <gasps> yeah. It's so difficult, you can't quite see whether or not you have actually extinguished the fire or not. It's a bit difficult. Let me through. Thank you. Okay. Nice. I'll scan some stuff. I'll soon need to change the battery of this thing, apparently. Command chair. I mean, we, we, want, we want stuff like this, right? I love that. <laughs> I love that so much. What is this? Single wall shelf. Interesting. Oh, wait. Do I have the vending machine? I do. Okay. And what's this? Met pack. Okay. Can't open this. That's this, though. Today's menu. Uh, yeah, you guys can read that if you wish. That's just a menu. Not really relevant to us at the moment. You know what? I'm gonna do it. Not like I'm gonna live here, but still. Ugh. Oh dear, this is a maze. Ooh. Bed? Oh. Okay. Let's, uh. Use you. Definitely. Definitely want a bed. I mean, I wonder, can we sleep in it? Maybe if we make it? I don't know. Ooh, Ooh, another poster. I definitely want the posters. I really want the posters. Okay. Uh. Okay. Happen. It's better be worth all the fire extinguishing. Okay, another PDA, another disinfected water. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. A carry-all? Wait, is this a backpack? Wait, so if I just, like, maybe... Uh, do something like this, right? Like, in theory. And maybe put the empty battery in there. Back is not empty, cannot pick up. Oh, it has to be empty. And then my inventory is full. Okay. I see how it is. Um, I don't wanna... No. No. I don't need it. I don't need it. It's fine. Fine. Tell her, um, 
what? Oh dear. Uh, okay, you guys can read that as well if you wish. Alright, moving on. Okay, that's a lot of fire extinguishing needing to be done. Yep, cabin five. Doesn't look like I'll actually be able to head on over there, so I'll just do this. Yeah, because I can't. I don't think I can actually move those pillars. Cabin six, on the other hand. Okay, it's empty. Another first aid kit. Another battery. Okay. No PDA data. Okay, so that's the end of this hallway. And how did I miss this? I first came in here. More disinfected water. Very good. So we basically don't need to worry about anything. Um, cabin one. Is this the one that we got earlier? Like the... Uh, Codes and clues. Lab of high security terminal. 2679. 26, uh, 79. Is that not it? Hmm. I guess that's not it. Interesting. Empty. Uh. Can't access. Okay, empty as well. Nothing actual in here. Here, okay. Ooh, that's very close to the head. I just realized cabin two is blocked off. Ooh, captain quarters. Okay, so this is twenty six seven nine. Okay, open door. Okay, what can I scan here? Basic double bed. Okay, I'll take it. And we have a PDA thing there. But most importantly, though. Ooh, miniature, I want that. Wall shelves, we need, we need those as well. We're getting so much good stuff here. This is very productive. Okay. Inventory full? Oh, come on. Okay, I'll eat something now. I think that's... Ooh, 140! I didn't know it counted for that. I didn't know it counted like that. That's cool. I uh, don't need to drink that much, so... I'll grab that. And we'll grab this. Captain's log. Okay, loading program, uh, size, what? You're exploring a quiet alien, this is just, uh, okay. This seems like a game. You you guys can read this if you wish. Uh, <laughs> okay, interesting. Uh, there we go. Latest recorded. Ooh, f escape rocket. But it's not really what I wanted to get to, though. I wanted to have time cap time capsule. Captain's log. That's not it. Where's the last recorded transmission? Let's go. Average long range transmission delay eight hours. Opening last recorded transmissions. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet four five four six B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond with rescue solution out. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that Ooh. we calculate will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find and sit you, but it's going to need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure to... Aurora Long Range Communications Ooh. really offline. We have a power source. You know those alien cubes? We have a power source. We really do have a power source. And... They have materials. This is cool. We already have that poster? I think so, yes. Okay. How do I get in here, though? I feel like that's a code I've missed. Uh... I'm serious. Data download, alien data that is not in our own survivors. Um, I'm just looking, gonna scan these for a code. I don't see why it would be in a crew lock, though. But in case someone was saying it, that would be great because I really want to access this. No code in here either. And no code in here. Codes and clues. 
high security terminal. We got that. We got the lab access. Notes to self. Tackle Bay code. Okay, that's not it, but we'll try it anyway. 1454. Okay, oh, cargo bait code. Oh, that's what the one that we need further down. Ooh, okay. I don't think I can actually access this, and I don't want to... Cabin 1. Okay, it's not a data thing that I've actually gotten just yet. So that's interesting, but I... I think I've been through... All these rooms now. And... Wait... Oh yeah, that's cabin one. I don't think I've missed a PDA anywhere. I say that, and I have missed picking up water, apparently. <laughs> Which is not very good. But I think unless I've missed something very obvious, I've gotten all the PDA files that I could. I'm gonna actually drop some of these because I have way too many health packs. I would rather, much rather have the batteries. Mm, okay, yeah, I could look it up, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to look. Ooh, I want that poster. <laughs> I want that poster. I'm assuming... Yeah, I can't actually pick up this stuff. So I can't access Kevin 5. Okay, I guess the last place for us to go now is back here. And then make sure I didn't miss a PDA file in here. Make sure I didn't miss anything in here. So if we find it at some point later down the road, we'll have to come back and see what we missed out on. Eh, would you please let me through. All right. Back in this place now. And that's blocked off, but can we get this? We can. Hurt a little bit, but that's fine. We got the prawn suits. There could be a... Where is it? Oh, that's that. Okay. I was like, what's making splashing sounds? <laughs> um, yeah, I don't think I'm missing anything from here. All right. Let's head through here, I suppose. This is the locker room. Let's see if we get something down here. This is underwater. My inventory is so full, it is unbelievable. I'm actually going to take the battery rather than that. Oh, what's that? Oh! Okay. Integrating new PDA data. Hello. Sweet offer, you're telling me you've been on this rig more than a year and you never took a ride on the outside. Well, now, you're only gone and gotten yourself a friend with the keys to a giant freaking robot suit. Ooh. We plain we we've plain got nothing to do till we get star side to work on the gate. You want to taste the stars? You've only got to say. My spare prawn suit's got your name on it. You don't know what power feels like till you've cruised and an asteroid with your bare, heavily mechanically augmented hands. Wanna play catch with a passing meteor? Come by cabin number one codes. Ooh! Codes uh, cabin number eighteen sixty nine. Okay. We'll do that afterwards. So many batteries. That is great. Um, I can't actually have all of them. Is there anything I can drop? Maybe a couple of health health packs. Okay. Very good. Uh, can I get air here? Yep. Okay, that is... I recognize a door like that. That's a door that can be cut through late. Oh, wait, another PDA. Integrating new PDA. Uh, auxiliary mission orders. Uh, disappeared almost a decade ago, carrying with it a high... Wait. Target proof the Mongolian vessel Degassi. Last known position. That's this planet. Contract. Or, or a contact. Mongolian em emissary. I can't pronounce that. Aurora passenger quarters. Mission brief. A Mongolian vessel, the Degassi, disappeared almost a decade ago, carrying with it a high-ranking Mongolian chief. Corporate Insurance has purchased passage aboard the Aurora for Emissary Hassar, and your orders are to make every reasonable effort to locate and retrieve the Degassi crew members without compromising the primary mission. Confirming the fate of the crew will aid all terrorist diplomatic efforts with the Mongolian councils. Wait, hold on, so someone else went before us? And a secondary mission of the Aurora was to find these people? Mission details, Aurora is due to perform a slingshot maneuver around... Oh dear. 
approximately 13 months post launch. This will bring the ship within range of the Degassi slash normal position. Additional aquatic and all terrain vehicles have been included in the Aurora's cargo package for this mission. The Degassi crew manifesto has been distributed to senior employees in a separate message. Interesting. Okay. That's very interesting. Did we know that before? I feel like we didn't know that before. So a secondary mission was to explore or land, not land, but send a crew down to this uh, planet if we could get contact, I guess. Maybe. Very interesting background story stuff we are discovering here. All right, let's go through this. Mm hmm, found bay and locker room. Well, what is in this direction then? That's a question. There's stuff down there. Stuff in here. Seamoth Bay. Dry room. Damaged wiring. I can repair that. Oh boy. Cool. Water. I'll take water. Uh, I can't access that, can I? No. I can scan something around here, though. I got the scan symbol, I'm pretty sure. Or maybe I can... Oh, I can go up here. Oh, nice. Okay. This is a creepy place, not gonna lie. More water. Can I get more water? Nope. Well, the inventory's full. Oh, okay. Do I have some of the lesser water? I do not. Alright. <laughs> I hate leaving stuff behind, though. Ugh! Okay. Ooh. More water? Okay, it definitely came over prepared. Nutrient block, though, is beautiful. I don't need that. That's... I really shouldn't have brought this, the sea glide, but oh well. Transco profile. Uh, can trace their roots back to Earth. Altera literally meaning by Earth is only one. Uh, Altera supplied arms to all sides. Wait, weapons? Acquiring and housing a vast colonist workforce and work and making the transition from manufacturer to corporate state. Altera's threat to cease trade was one of the turning points in the conflict bringing about the end of hostilities and the signing of the Charter. Free enterprise within Altera space is encouraged, but competition is tight, and all goods exported off-world must be Altera branded. Profitable businesses are bought out by the state, owners are sending to the board of directors. Well-known Altera technologies like the Cyclops submersible originated with such private enterprises. Interesting. Where is this leading us is my question at the moment. And what can I potentially find around here? More water. Like, I might as well drink a water when I see a water and grab it. Because I don't know. I, I, I might as well. <laughs> it's a waste just leaving it there, I suppose. Can I get up there? Oh, there's a staircase. Right. More of these. Nutrient block. Can I eat one? I cannot. Okay, I have to be below zero for it to actually work properly. Uh, there was a lot of other doors back there. I don't know where this is leading us. I really... Oh, hello! This is back from where we... Okay. That code is... Uh, that That's the door I was trying to open earlier. Okay. Right. That makes sense. Well, with that done and said, I guess we're going back down here. And we shall continue exploring. So that's the Seamoth Bay. We'll do that last, I suppose. This is the dry room. Oh, but what if we do something and won't be able to come back? Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're going in here first. <laughs> With that message, I don't know if we'll be able to come back here. So we're gonna repair this. We're going in here. Maybe we'll find something useful. Just a close room. Okay. PDA via suit log. Virtual reality. Virtual reality. Uh. Spawning players on beach player one has been washed away. <laughs> okay, you guys can read this. That's kind of funny. Oh dear. 
This better not be from what has actually happened. Oh, see my breath. Hello. I don't really need that. Already have that. Can I open this door? I don't think so. Okay. I think we are ready to go to the drive core. Or the drive room. Which then has the drive core, I assume. Okay. Right. Fire should be extinguished. Let's go. I think this is the final place in the Aurora that we haven't actually been to just yet. Let's extinguish all of this. Alright. Oh dear. Why am I sensing, you know, a timer for getting out? Okay, in case we have to run, I can't go through all of it again. I think the safest place is to go through the door that I just found. I'm, got, I'm just, I'm just going to save it here, you know. Just in case. Okay. Mm hmm. Oh dear. Oh dear. No signal. Cyclops actually efficient. Warning. Local radiation at maximum tolerable level. Got it. So this is radioactive. Cyclops engine, efficiency module, inventory for... No, I'm getting that. I'm... Uh, I have to drop something, don't I? Oh, there we go. See, what... Why does it keep... Like, the scan icon sometimes just pops up and then immediately disappears again. It's being very weird. Okay, let's try this place here. Maybe there's some other upgrades that I can get that I then don't have to spend materials getting. I'm not sure what I'm doing in here in this engine, though. There's nothing here. Okay. Time to down, dive down, I suppose. Breach. Okay, let's scan the breach. Drive core shielding breach. The Aurora's drive core is shielded by a thick metal shell which breached in multiple locations shortly after the crash. Once breached, it will continue to leak radiation into the surrounding environment. Oh! Oh, hello! What on earth was that? What on- Okay, the water is not safe. Get me up, please. Oh! Okay. Let's try that again. Once breached, it will continue to leak radiation into the surrounding environment until the breaches are sealed. After that point, the radiation in the environment will dis dissipate over time. This procedure should only be attempted with appropriate radiation protection and a fully charged repair tool. I feel like that that is a very clear message to me. Repair tool. Fully charged, it says. We will go ahead and put in a fresh battery. And we will go ahead and try this. Hmm. We will save again. And we will now attempt repairing. Containment breach repaired. Further breaches detected. Ten. Okay. Should be nine after this one, yeah? Containment breach yep. repaired. Yep, okay. Further breaches detected. Let's do one pillar at a time, I suppose. There's another one down here. I just need to be careful of that weird creature. If it attaches again, I'll have to kill it with the knife this time. Here. If we can do this, then that would be really good, so we don't leak any more radiation. It's acting like there's another breach here. There's. Alright, let's get this one. Then this pillar should be fully repaired. Another one here. And that is this one done. Okay, this is doable. This is very much doable. Ah. Got attacked again. Got it, though. Come on. Ah! How many are there? A lot, apparently. Can I please? A bleeder. Oh, come on. Go away. 
That's a lot of them. Okay, I just have to work faster, I suppose. Work faster than they can swim. Please. <laughs> okay, two more. Two more remaining. Let's get it done. This is the final second one. There we go. Yeah, one more. We'll have to try and locate somewhere. That is. Look for the sparks. And this should be the final one. According to this. Radiation level decreasing. Drive core breach sealed. Repair the Aurora reactor. I got an achievement for that. Drive core breach sealed. Radiation levels decreasing. Nice. We did something. I think we succeeded our mission. So we stopped the leaking of the reactor, which is exactly what we came here to do, because it was becoming unstable. Ladies and gentlemen, I think we did it. I think we actually just did it. Okay. Now there's one more room. Can I pick you up? Or are you the empty one? Nope, uh, half empty, okay. Now, if it comes with a timer now, <laughs> that would be not cool. Okay, I want to go back to... Yeah, we went through... Wait, that's green. That is green. Is that supposed to be green? Yeah, okay. Let's go back to the cabin. So it's that one room that we got the code for, and then I think we're done here. But now, it would appear that we can return later uh, because this place is no longer unstable and about to blow I suppose I mean it's still on fire but you know we can deal with that and I really hope I haven't missed like just uh, missed scanning something okay I am looking for a sweet offer 1869 1869, 1869. Here it is. 1869. This better be good. Open door. Ooh. Okay. PDA. What else we got? Ooh. Blue cap. I mean, I guess I'll take it. Anything decorational, right? And I'll have the water. I don't really need that. Ooh. Arcade gorge toy. I really want that. Um, I don't really... Uh, flashback is almost dead. Actually, hold on. That probably is a way to recharge the battery. But for now, I'm just gonna let that battery kind of... Yeah, go bye-bye. Alright, let's take this. Responsible autonomous relationships. Integrating new PDA data. Uh, oh dear. Yeah, you guys can read that if you wish. <laughs> All right, I think that's that, ladies and gentlemen. Now, the way I'm gonna get out is probably the easiest way is to go, I think, back to the lockout room. I'm actually slowly losing my directions here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was this way, and then in here, and then up here, and then once up here, Ah! Oh, that jump scare! It's <laughs> I, I want to leave now. I don't like this anymore. I was going to say we can exit over here. Oh, well, that jump scared me. Okay. Good. 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 Uh, I could use the bolting cannon, but I got out before without it. But it should be doable. Yep. There we go. Nice. All right. Uh, yeah, we. I think we went through it all. I think. You guys will have to let me know if I missed something down below in the comments. But I think we got all the important stuff. Still feels very unstable. It's still on fire. Um, can I just jump? Ow. Can I, like, jump from here? I'm gonna save. I'm gonna try. Whee! Oh, I got nice. 
Yeah, I think, I think we got what we what we could get from this place. Unless, of course, there's something beneath the ship we haven't actually gotten yet. But I also don't want to risk getting close to that creature again. That last time we came too far out. Yeah, well, let's, let's turn back. Let's turn back. This place is also being very, very shaky. And I don't know how much it can be trusted. But I would consider that, ladies and gentlemen, a very successful mission. We got a new radio transmission waiting back at home. And we have so, so many scans. Like, we can make a prawn suit now. Which we'll have to look at how much stuff we actually need for that. That is very exciting. And we are finally home. Home sweet home. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, this was a very successful mission. I need to go through my inventory. I need to sort uh, things through. And we have a radio message, which we're going to be listening to in the next episode, because I gotta go. I really hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new and want to see more. And I hope to see you in the next one, which uh, is gonna be interesting. So, until then, have a wonderful rest of your day, and goodbye.